Today, I'm calling for the abolishment of history classes in Illinois. We're concerned that current school history teachings lead to white privilege. Still real life? Yep, just checking. I'm calling on the State Board of Education to end the teaching of history and the local school districts to take immediate action by removing the current history books and curriculum practices that unfairly communicate our history until a suitable alternative is developed. We should instead devote greater attention towards civics and ensure students understand our democratic process and how they can be involved. Today, I don't know the party of individuals here, and I'm sure we have people from different parties, but today this is an issue that brings us all together, and that is getting our history right. So we may have Republicans, Democrats, um, independents, but it doesn't matter when you're talking about civics and getting our history right, and that's why we all stand together today to make sure that that happens. What you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. The character to move beyond politics and serve every American, no matter where they live or what they believe. Since its founding in 1829, the Democratic Party has fought against every major civil rights initiative and has a long history of discrimination. The Democratic Party defended slavery, started the Civil War, opposed Reconstruction, founded the Ku Klux Klan, imposed segregation, perpetrated lynchings, and fought against the Civil Rights Acts of the 1950s. I was a Democratic caucus. There been no caucus? No, you haven't. You're a lying dog-faced pony soldier. Cocaine's a hell of a drug.